Um, I kind of switched with, uh, oh my god, step in. What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kaziana. If you don't know me already, today's video is going to be about Fenty skin. I'm going to give my review on the Fenty starter kit. And I'm also going to be talking about their overnight gel cream, which I have right here. So I'm going to be talking about those four items. It's going to be super quick because I don't really have much to say. I'm just going to give my overall opinion. So if you would like to see what I have to say about it, continue watching this video. So I'm going to be reviewing each product in the order that it comes in. So the first thing you have here is the Fenty Skin Total Cleanser, Remove It All Cleanser. This is the first step in the three-step or I should say the four-step routine. Um, this is just your basic cleanser. You use it day and night to remove makeup, dirt, and impurities. So I have a little video that I'm going to be showing right here. I'm basically just showing you how I use it. And I really enjoy this cleanser. It's very, like the formula is very soft, um, silky, I would say. It has like a nice velvety touch to it. And it makes my skin feel very smooth and dewy after i finish using it i really like how it makes my skin feel i get no irritation i have sensitive skin so i feel like that's something i should point out that it doesn't give me any irritation no redness nothing like that no breakouts it's very very gentle on the skin so i definitely recommend go picking that up the second step in the routine is um your toner right after the cleanser so they have this fat water pore refining toner serum i really like the formula of this as well use on day and night after you clean your skin apply all over your face using your fingers or a cotton pad i kind of switch it up with this um sometimes i use my fingers sometimes i use a cotton round it's just whatever i'm in the mood for that day to be honest but i feel like using it with your skin and just rubbing it directly onto your skin with your fingers i feel like that works best for me i also have a video including that and i pretty much just pat it into my skin as soon as i'm done i don't know i feel like that just does something for me i saw someone else do it online i'm just like you know what i'm gonna do that too so i can like feel like how does it feel on my skin and it does leave i would say it does leave like a little tacky-ish feeling. Like you definitely feel like you have something on your face. Like as if it's um, tightening your pores a little bit. Which is the point of the product. So just I just wanted to remind you guys that that is what it feels like after you use it. I know a lot of toners are very strong. And they also cause a lot of irritation. Which is why I didn't use toners before. But I really like this one. And I think it's one of my favorite products of the set of four that I have. I really like using this. No matter what cleanser I use, I always use this toner afterwards. I find myself gravitating towards it a lot. And yeah, I've been using it for only like two or three weeks. And I haven't used that much. A little goes a long way. And another thing I want to point out is it is gentle around the eye area. I use it to take off like any extra eye makeup, mascara, which is obviously the point of toner. But... You know, sometimes toner scares you a little bit. You know, you don't want to use it in that area. They usually tell you not to um, use it around your eyes. But it doesn't have that warning here. And I've used it where I'm like, I'm literally rubbing it into my eye to get all that gunk out and all that extra mascara. And it didn't burn. It didn't irritate me. Nothing. Like, I had no problem using it in my eyes. So yeah, that's the Fat Water. Really nice product. Moving on to the next one. Okay, so the third step after um, using the toner, this is your sunscreen. It's called the Hydrovisor Invisible Moisturizer Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Sunscreen. Looks like this. I like the sunscreen. Um, I'm not gonna lie. Like I wasn't a sunscreen person before, but after using this, I really see the difference in my skin as far as radiance goes, as far as any redness. And it doesn't leave a white cast. It doesn't, like, I have no bad things to say about this. You can also use it um, as a primer before your makeup. I haven't done that as of yet, but I would like to try that. Because I usually don't wear makeup. Like, you, know, you guys never really see me wearing makeup a lot. But I definitely do use this in the morning right before I get to work. And, you know, it be having my skin glowing. It be having my skin glowing. I'm going to tell you that right now. When I was not using sunscreen, I would find myself getting very flared up right here. Like, no matter what. Like, indoor heat, outside heat. Like, 
for some reason my my cheeks always got really red i don't know if it was like my body temperature i don't know the scientific stuff behind it but all i know is that there will be times that my face would just be like super red right here and i wouldn't even know why like literally like my family or my boyfriend would just be like why are you so red and like what do you mean they're like yo like your your cheeks are like blushing red right now and they would like it was so like crazy i'm just like i don't know like i don't know why and i don't know if it's because i wasn't using sunscreen but i've noticed that when i do use the sunscreen i don't have that issue anymore so it gotta be the sunscreen it gotta be the sunscreen and the last product i'm gonna share with you guys is the overnight gel cream i still don't remember the name of this i don't know what it's called overnight gel cream i think that's what it's called um i've really 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 like this it looks like this i've used a little bit already so you use this overnight obviously this is like the last step in your routine and i've definitely noticed a difference in the morning when i wake up my skin looks so flawless very plump like you don't see any redness whatsoever i actually just used it right before filming this video so if you can see like i think i have a little bit of redness here but i think it's because i was like i was just touching my face just now like that's how sensitive my skin is guys like i can literally touch my face and it'll turn red i don't know why but <laughs> yeah anyways i really like how this feels on the skin it gives me a really nice finish like super ready for bed and in the morning like my skin just be really glowing um i do retain a lot of water but i've never seen my skin like this like it's called okay here's the name of it instant reset overnight recovery gel cream this is why i can't remember the name of it because they put twenty thousand words on the back of the goddamn bottle and then it has this little like compact thing it's, it's a mirror here whoa whoa but yeah so it has a little mirror here and if you have nails i don't have nails but when i do get nails this will be really like nice to use it has like this little like a little spoon i don't I don't know but this is really nice to like just dig into the product and spread it on without getting it all into your nails and digging your nails in there so that's cute and you could also use that little mirror part to twist the cap off so it's like it's it's so cute and you can even refill it these are like these are refillable so that's really cute so like once it's done you pop off the bottom and all you have to do is replace this part and you keep this and you keep the top so that's awesome i just wanted to throw that in there random thought but yes if i plan on going on vacation which i kind of do i'm definitely taking i think i'm taking the whole set with me like because they're a mini size like if you haven't noticed i have all the mini size starter kits only because i don't like wasting money especially on products that i don't know if i'm gonna like it and i was just feeling a little cheap that day so <laughs> i'm definitely gonna go back and get the bigger ones but yeah right now i do have the mini ones and they've been lasting a little while like i said i would take it with me if i wanted to travel i would take all four of those and i think i would be set as far as skincare goes all right guys so that was all i had to show you guys today that was my most honest review i can give for y'all um it was pretty like straightforward straight to the point um i gave you guys like my pros and cons which i didn't have many many um cons yeah, that was my review for those products. <laughs> Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you put on the little notification bell for any future videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.